Hello everyone, Marco Cipetta for Hot Hardware here to give you a quick look at the brand new Asus PadPhone X Mini. Now at first glance, the PadPhone X Mini may look like any other smartphone, but it includes a unique dock that essentially lets you use the phone as a tablet. Let's take a look. The front of the PadPhone X Mini is pretty standard fare. You have a earpiece right here with a front-facing 2 megapixel camera. Other than that, there's nothing else on the front. The buttons are soft buttons that are actually right on the screen down here. On the left side, there's really nothing to see except for this notch that allows you to remove the back. On the top, we have a microphone and a 3.5 millimeter headphone jack. On the left side, you'll find the volume rocker and power button. On the bottom, you have the micro USB charging port along with another microphone. And on the back is a five megapixel camera with flash and a speaker. Overall, the PadPhone X Mini seems to perform pretty well. As you can see, sliding through home screens is nice and smooth. So is sliding through the apps here. And let me bring up the browser for a second. Here's the hot hardware site. As you can see, scrolling is nice and fast and smooth. And pinch and zoom is responsive. Graphics performance is also pretty good on the Asus PadPhone X Mini. Here's the FutureMark 3DMark Ice Storm benchmark running. And multimedia playback is also pretty good. Here is a uh, full screen HD video streaming from YouTube of the Avengers 2 Age of Ultron trailer. The PadPhone X Mini has a five megapixel rear facing camera that does a pretty good job taking shots in a variety of lighting conditions. It's not the best camera on the market, but it'll definitely get you by. There's also plenty of customization options. You have a mode button here to switch between, you know, auto mode, HDR, panorama, or night shots. There's also tons of user selectable options for white balance, ISO, exposure value, um, resolution. There is really a ton of stuff in here. And you also have plenty of art filters if you like to mess with, you know, sepia tones or grayscale hues, what have you. Now this tablet dock is what really makes the Asus PadPhone X Mini unique. Now on its own, it's just a screen with a camera, you know, and a few buttons, but if you take the PadPhone X Mini and slide it in right here, you essentially turn it into a tablet. When the PadPhone X Mini is in its dock, it has a 7-inch screen with a resolution of 1280 by 800 but not much else changes. The software and the hardware in the phone are still what's powering the device. So on this side, you have the power button, volume rocker, and charging port but not much else changes. On the back, you can see the phone in the dock and you do end up with this larger speaker, which is definitely better for consuming media. The additional battery in the dock also extends battery life considerably. ASUS claims 15.8 hours of talk time with just the phone, but when docked, you get up to 28.3 hours. We hope you've enjoyed this quick look at the ASUS PadPhone X Mini. If you want more details and a full suite of benchmarks, be sure to come by the site and check out the full review. Once again, this is Marco Cipetta for Hot Hardware. Thanks for stopping by.